Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at running Big Capital, an accounting and inventory software, in Docker. To begin, connect to the device where we're going to install Docker. We'll start by using apt install to install a few prerequisite packages. Next, we'll add the Docker GPG key and apt repository. Now using apt install, we'll install docker, docker compose, and container d. With the docker packages installed, we'll make sure the docker service is started and enabled. Add the current user to the docker group. Then re-authenticate the current user for the group change to take effect. We're now ready to start running containers. We'll start by creating a working directory for our container to store persistent data in. Then using the git clone command, we'll pull the source code for big capital from GitHub. We'll cd to our working directory. Then create a copy of the .env.example file and edit it in nano. Using the video description as a guide, update the database and email variables, base URL, and proxy ports. Once completed, save your changes and close out of nano. With our config file ready to go, we'll use the docker compose command to create our container stack. This will take a few minutes to complete as our containers are being built. Once the containers are up and running, open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the docker host, colon 8000. Click the sign up link to create a new account. Complete the form by entering a first name, last name, email and password, then click register. Complete the organization details form, then click save and continue at the bottom. On the congratulations page, click go to dashboard. Welcome to Big Capital, running containerized in Docker.